to get out of the house and do something fun, why not come down to the Nibco Water and Ice Park in downtown Elkhart? The park was established back in 2007 thanks to a donation from the Rex and Alice Martin Foundation. And one of the things that keeps community members like Megan Beck coming back is the unique design of the rink. I like that it's a circle and you go around things and it's not just like a rink, you know, there's like things to look at and it's interesting. While many people appreciate the rink's design, they may not know just how unique the Nibco Water and Ice Park really is. Jameson Zarnecki, the superintendent of Parks and Recreation for the city of Elkhart, said the rink's design is one of the first of its kind. It's based off of, of um, Nordic traditional fjords uh, and the way that those look in a natural system. And so it was the first of the country to be designed with that in mind. Um, to look like a natural sort of stream and fjord on the canals out there. If you haven't been to the rink yet, this weekend is your last chance before it closes for season and the rink shifts into something else for the warmer months. During the spring, um, we change it into a splash bag. We also use that for events. And so we have our Summer Chill series is a um, music series that we do there. Although the ice rink will soon come to a close, there's a lot more activities and programs to look forward to in the community. And you can find out more about those at elkhartindiana.org slash parks. For Globe News, I'm Katie Day.